What's going on everybody? Good morning. It is Saturday. We're one day out from the Toronto Pro Super Show. So, uh, the past couple videos, the days have just gotten crazy. I kind of left you hanging. Uh, didn't get a ton recorded. I'm trying my best here guys, but it's just a busy, busy time up here trying to get everything done. Having to take Ubers to the grocery store, trying to edit the videos I'm, I've already recorded. So I'm doing, I'm doing my best, but you know, forgive me if they're not a uh, professional style videos and I'm capturing everything. I'm going to capture as much as I can today because uh, today is pretty much going to be a chill, eat, pose, eat, pose. We are going to run to Pure Muscle Gym um, and get a quick pump in this morning. Some, nothing crazy, mostly just move some of these, this food around and uh, do some posing. Never been to the gym before too, so it'll be pretty cool. I've heard it's a pretty awesome gym. I'm sure a lot of people have seen videos of people training at that gym, so that'll be fun. But anyways, the carb up is going pretty well. Um, I haven't really gained any weight as far as carbing up. I actually lost weight, even though we ate a good amount of carbs. I don't know where we left off on the last video, but I had a couple more meals uh, still with a decent amount of carbs. You know, But everything so far has been rice, cream of rice, rice cakes with like four ounces, four to five ounces of uh, protein, beef or chicken. So nothing crazy so far. We haven't had any treats or any goodies, but uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, he starts throwing some of that stuff in today and really fills me out. But anyways, we're gonna start today off meal one with four ounces of 96 four lean ground beef and 128 grams of cream of rice. So that's, and then I get, we're measuring water today too. So I get eight ounces of water, eight ounces of coffee. And uh, he's just gonna tell me meal by meal, how much fluid to drink in each meal. And every two hours I'm sending check-in pictures and wait. And then he tells me what to eat. So. I don't know what's coming next. I know I'm gonna get this down and then we're gonna move on. Uh, I'll send pictures in about two hours and he'll tell me what to eat before we go train at Pure Muscle. So that's the plan right now. Pretty much only using mustard as a condiment. And uh, yeah, I'm starving. So I'm gonna get this down. Like my body's burning through everything. We ate a good amount of food yesterday but I don't feel filled out at all. I just, uh, but I, I did wake up hard and dry as hell. So another thing he's made me implement, which is crazy for me. I have not drank alcohol in five and a half years since my wedding. And he's got me doing a few ounces of vodka. He had me do like three ounces right before bed last night, just to help me sleep better, dry me out a little bit more. So, that was odd getting down. I hadn't touched alcohol in so long, but uh, I do think it helped. It you know calms the nerves and helped me sleep a little better throughout the night. So you know, bring those cortisol levels down and help you sleep a little better. It's always a good thing. Your body responds so much better when it's real, well rested and less stressed. So meal one going down. And I'm going to keep you guys updated throughout the day. Um, hopefully we get some treats. Whew. All right. It is time for meal two. And it's also going to be the pre-workout with meal. Not really a workout. Uh, Ashley might get a real workout. And yes, I will. Birthday girl, by the way. Leave a comment. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday to Ashley. The, uh, I don't know if I should say your age. I don't know. Is, is that allowed? <laughs> the, the big three O, so thirty. All right. So uh, yeah, happy birthday to Ash Ashley. We're gonna go get a. I'm gonna get a tiny little pump at Pure Muscle and Fitness. She's gonna get a real workout probably. But pre workout meal. This is meal number two. Carving up. We've got five four ounces of 
90-10 bison, 250 grams of rice, and then I get 25 carbs from uh, rice cakes. And of course, with all my carb up meals, I'm taking my uh, glucose disposal agent, my Performax Slim, um, helps shuttle the carbs. And uh, I get eight ounces of water and eight ounces of coffee with this meal as well. That's my pre-workout. I will still have a scoop of Vasomax during the training for the extra pump. And uh, yeah, that's it. Sodiums uh, on the lower end, I'm just barely putting like a eighth of a teaspoon of sodium on each meal. So uh, we're keeping sodium in, but we're not very high on it. And water is lower too. So, but we're getting enough water in to shuttle the carbs. You don't want to cut it completely out. You want enough that's still going to be able to digest the carbs. If you cut too much out, you just start getting backed up. You can't go to the bathroom and everything like that. So I'm going to get this meal in, like I said, and uh, we're going to go see what this Pure Muscle and Fitness Gym is all about. And uh, since I'm not going to be doing much, maybe I'll video actually doing some workouts. And then I'll probably, they've all, I always see people posing there. So I'm going to try and hit some posing there and some decent lighting. And maybe I'll give you all a peek of that as well. I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and do so instinctive and so passionate Every word I move so descriptive like an adjective I got a vendetta against people who patented it Being negative when you should be getting after it I got facts over facts over tracks This and that spitting slow, spitting fast I can roast, I can gas, think I'm okay at last But I don't know if that can erase all the past And the pettiness, a reflection of the emptiness Hilarious, you think you're worth my time, you're delirious Mysterious, because you hide behind a fake exterior Inferior, you know I'll always be a bit superior Get off of me, this ain't no humble brag I want you to hear words, you can say them back I want you to feel free from the chains at last And to believe in what you got, it was built to last, yeah now that I've been put through, I never got anyone's help. I had to do it all myself. I don't ever slow up, no, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fake music. We're back from the gym. Took a lot longer than uh, anticipated, so coach just wants me to hurry up and eat, take a nap, put my feet up. So traffic was crap on the way back. It was fine on the way there, but on the way back, it was crazy. Plus, the girls were getting a full-on leg workout, so I just needed like a 20-minute pump and some posing, and they went all out. So, uh, I'm starving. I'm going to get this down. I'm going to make it short and sweet. We got four ounces of 90-10 bison and 250 grams of rice, and then I get another 20, uh, 21 carbs from rice cakes. And that's basically it. I also, with this my meal... Ugh, I get what he calls a death shot. So we get vodka and coffee. Yum. Whatever works, right? We're good. We're putting it all in. Hot. And uh, yeah, whatever, whatever works. We're coming in, we're getting harder, we're getting drier, we're getting fuller. So it's working, I'm sticking to the plan. And uh, right now, like I said, I'm starving. I still need to hop in the shower. Make sure uh, my skin's exfoliated and all the hairs off of it in case I missed any spots. So we got spray tanning in about two hours. So I am gonna finish this, hop in the shower, take a nap. All right guys, here we go. An ounce and a half of black coffee, three ounces of vodka. That's what we call the death shot. I don't know if I can take it all at once. She's laughing. That came out wrong. But, oh. I'm definitely laughing at you. Three ounces of vodka when you haven't drank in five, five and a half years. 
Oh goodness, this is gonna be brutal. And I don't really like coffee. Ooh, man up. <laughs> Got about half of it down. Do it, do oh, it. Oh, God. You got this. I'm not a drinker anymore. I got some stories I could tell you from back in the day. If you want to hear stories about my uh, pre-bodybuilding days, let me know in the comments. There's some doozies. But, uh, whew, I don't miss it. <laughs> I don't miss it. And I used, to, I used to show up to a party with a half gallon of Crown or Captain Morgan and just walk around drinking out of the freaking bottle. Back in my party days before bodybuilding. <laughs> Now I'm struggling to get two shots of vodka down. Ugh. Oh, God. All right. Last little bit. Whew. And I'm going to take a nap. probably look like a pussy <laughs> but uh, it's what happens when you don't drink for five and a half years and then oh you got to do that who got to give my sobriety chip back now <laughs> uh, all right time to shower and take a nap before going down and getting my first coat of spray tan Whew. all right we are back from getting spray tan nice and dark see how it looks. Ooh. So, first coat of tan is on and time to eat again. Still nothing fun. I'm like, why did, why did coach make me buy all these goodies and we're not having even touched them yet? And tomorrow's the show. This is going to have a bunch of junk food left over and that wasn't the plan. But whatever, the goal is to be our best. And that's what we're gonna do. So it's working, and that's what we're gonna keep pushing. So we got four ounces of 9010 bison. We've got 140 uh, grams dry weight of cream of rice, and then mixed in with that for some extra fats to slow the digestion down a little bit because we're burning through everything so fast. We got 10 grams of ghee butter. Um, so yeah, I've never had ghee butter actually, but he said mac oil or ghee butter. This is what we ended up getting. This is what the grocery store had. So I didn't have any mac oil. So that's what we're gonna do. So that is my next meal. I think we're on meal, I don't know, five now here. It's uh, like 5.45 and yeah, he just wants me to eat this, put my feet up, relax, take a nap, chill. At six o'clock, another three ounces of vodka. I'm gonna be freaking hungover tomorrow if we keep going like this. But with this meal, I get six ounces of coffee. And then at six, I'm supposed to have three ounces of freaking vodka again. After not drinking alcohol in five years, I'm surprised I'm not getting drunk yet off of it. But. It is what it is. I'm going to get this down. And maybe he'll give me something a little crazier before bed to really fill me out. So we don't have to eat a ton in the morning. We wake up full, hard, dry, and uh, keep the stomach nice and tight in the morning. But like I said, this is our first time working together. We're feeling it out. We're figuring it out. And we seem to be getting better and better throughout the day. So we're just going to keep going. But I'm going to finish this meal, put my feet up, and relax. All right, time for meal five. I think we're on five. Anyways, <clears throat> still nothing crazy, nothing special. We're just, I uh, guess, keeping it pretty simple. This is our first time working together, like I've said probably too many times already. 
So I think he's just playing it a little safe, which is fine. We'll see how I respond. And, uh, you know, we've got another another show in four weeks in Orlando. So um, anything that could have been better after this show, we'll fix for that. But we're still looking good. We're still getting harder, drier, tighter, and a little fuller. So this meal, we've got 300 grams of jasmine rice, four ounces of top sirloin steak that trimmed all the fat. And then we get three of these chocolate caramel rice cakes, which I've never seen this flavor in the States, but they had it at Walmart here and it freaking just sounded amazing. Here they are. And then I get, uh, I can't remember if it said 10 or 20 grams of honey on the rice cakes. All right, Manuka honey. He told me specifically Manuka honey. I don't know what's so special about Manuka honey, but bioactive honey. Maybe it'll turn me into the Hulk. <laughs> I don't know. So we did increase sodium a little bit now too. I get six ounces of water with this meal and sodium goes up by a quarter. So a quarter of more of what we were already doing. So, which wasn't much, but it's gonna go up a little bit now. And uh, yeah, pretty simple. We're just chilling, watching a movie. I'm gonna eat this, do some posing and put my feet up and relax again. So that's how it's going. That's basically the, the rest of my night. He said, we'll probably get one more meal in tonight. So in two hours, I'll send check-ins again. And uh, then we'll see what the final meal of the night is before going to bed and waking up at my best ever. And prejudging is not till like 10 and bodybuilding goes on last. So we'll probably get at least two good meals in tomorrow before I step on stage. But for now, steak and rice, rice cakes and honey. All right, final meal of the night, ready to pass out. Still starving and this is not gonna put a dent in my hunger, but it's what we've been ordered to do. So we got four ounces or five ounces, I already forgot. It's on my phone and she's holding my phone. So four or five ounces of uh, 9010 bison, 140 grams cream of rice with 10 grams of ghee butter. And then I get three to four ounces of vodka as the only fluids I'm allowed to drink with this meal. So yum. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I'm not gonna be full at all. I'm still starving, but my body itself is filling out. So uh, with the vodka, and we did take a quarter of a diazide, um, which is like the only diuretics we've taken this whole time. Like that's huge for me because last year we way overdid it. Sweating a little bit. Um, and uh, this year we've been drinking a good amount of water the whole time still, barely any diuretics. So my body's responding really well. And I think with that and the vodka, we're gonna dry out really well overnight and wake up hopefully looking just freaky nasty and shock some people on stage tomorrow. So I'm gonna get this last meal down, pass out like coach told me. I'll send my final weight to him before I go to bed and then we'll see how much my weight drops overnight. And that's then he'll know what to feed me in the morning. So. We're gonna pass out and finish watching Back to the Future. It's on commercial right now, but uh, gotta love Back to the Future, classic. I'm gonna shut up now, cause I'm rambling. So good night, and I will try to film as much as possible tomorrow on show day to take you guys through the experience with me. Hope you've enjoyed this one, and till the next time. <laughs>